Guys, this is this is a nice ass house. I heard a hot girl lives here, so I'm gonna knock on the door, see if she answers. Maybe I can uh, get a number for you guys for the video. Let's see. Oh, excuse me. Oh, sorry. Uh, hello, ma'am. Who are you? <laughs> I'm uh, your future lover. I'll probably ask you to marry you one. Wait. Um. Okay. Rude. <laughs> Hi, guys. Dang, girl. Let me let me in the house. Let me, let me, let me in the house. Hold on. Let me let me lock this door real quick. So no burger and come this in. is why you don't let strangers into oh, the house. Really? <laughs> I'm sorry. Nice I'm sorry. I just smacked the heck out of you. Okay. No. Guys, we had to start the video the exact same way. Well, kinda. We started our first house tour when we bought this house nine months ago. Wow, that's literally insane. the day before my birthday, we closed on it and we made the video our and house tour. I am really thankful that we were able to get this home when we did because when we bought our house, we bought it in the most craziest house marketing time in the world. When I tell you the housing market's still kind of crazy, but the housing market, you the house would go on the market. We would literally want to go look at it, and then our realtor would be like, "Uh, yeah, there's a pending sale." Yeah, and it just went on. Like the day before, so we had to be quick. We had to be really strategic. We really couldn't look around. That's what sucked. Like we really couldn't experience the whole like looking around process because you had to get it right away. I don't know how many houses your parents have looked at or you've looked at when you bought your home, but guess how many houses we looked at in total until we found our home? Two. Three. Yeah, this is the third, but it was This two. is the third house, but we only looked at two other houses. There was literally yeah. nothing on the market. But guys, we are not here to tell you the story of how we got the house. We are here to show you an updated yeah, house, house tour. tour throughout everything. We we are almost done we with basically to everything give in the house. you guys a fully furnished house tour because guys, we've updated so much in the I house. I cannot wait to show there you. There is so it's... many things. Like I want to do like a little bit of like a glimpse of the before and then the after. Yeah, stay tuned in this video because we're going to be showing you so much before and after footage and we just got our countertops in yesterday. yesterday. Yesterday our countertops went in. So there's really no better time to do this house tour, this furly furnished house tour until now. Are you ready, baby? Oh, I'm so I excited. I think we should just get into it because we have so, so much to show you. I'm so proud do. of us because we've been working and like the countertops is the last thing we wanted to do and it feels so good. That it's so fun. first thing is this foyer. This is the only thing that stayed in the house that was original. Was that ugly ass Ew. light. We still oh, have to get a new chandelier, so. I didn't, I didn't even know that was there. Yeah. I forgot that, that was there. And do I know it's funny? I painted the tip of that white, and I was gonna paint that white, but I can't take it off the ceiling without dewiring all of it, so. We need a new one, but starting in the foyer, guys, Mariah, do you wanna explain our decor that we got? Oh, we have this little cute little rug, you Ooh. know, so people walk in, they can. They can rub their feet, rub their toes, feel good. Yeah, they feel good. And then, of course, we have this little um, family. I feel like this is the perfect spot for this. Yeah. Family, a little bit of crazy, a little bit of loud, and a little bit of love. Wow. Yep. Don't get much loving around here, but moving yeah, on. Don't get enough loving. Also, while we go through the house, you'll also notice that the whole entire floor oh, yeah. and baseboard is different than the flooring that was originally in our house. We had this crappy 12 inch by 12 inch tile that was yellow, basically puke, and every single wall is white. So yeah. just keep that in mind while we show you the rooms. So yeah, guys, the house was a weird, actually we could show the yellow when we go into the room, but if it was, I, it was a, Yeah, I didn't paint one room yet. It was a ugly, like off white, and it just didn't look just good. A, like pea yellow. Like, oh, what do you guys think? What do you guys think of the new color? What do you think of the flooring? I feel like the flooring like really like brightened up the house. The it flooring really did. was so old before. And this was not here. This is our high tech security system yep. that um, if I arm it, basically a loud ass alarm will go on if any single window, door, crack, anything in, in the house opens up. Yeah. And if someone sh breaks the glass, if they throw a brick through the window, we have glass break sensors, so even if they get in the house with breaking the window and not opening up the door, it's still gonna go off. Yeah. But either way, yeah, good. we got a high tech alarm. Before we show the living room, oh, don't yeah. show too don't much, Don't show too okay? much. Should we just go We're over this? I think we went over here last time, right? Our bedroom. Oh, look, we gotta show this. A mom got this little decor Some right more here. decor. You didn't hang this up yet, did you? No, because when I painted, yeah, it's supposed so to be hanging there. that right there, but. But since we painted, like, I, I it's like been it's months. Kinda cute it's kind of cute like It's kind of cute, but I it still think be it's centered. better hang up. Yeah. Oh, and all the lights we changed in the house, so freaking nice oh, and white. Just wait to see. Just if you guys wait. don't have us on files on Instagram, make sure you follow us on Instagram, because we show you guys a little bit more sneak peek. All right, let's go. So our main bedroom, honestly, is one of my favorite parts of the house, guys, because look at the aesthetics in here. So we we got, still have LED lights that we want to put behind. We have to clean up a little bit more in here, but. TV in here. We got 
got our nice dresser. We added a little bit of a plant right here. I feel like it, we needed some more greenery. We need more greenery in the in the to liven up the area. Also, so like we said before, we're gonna be showing like the before and after. So if you guys didn't see the unfurnished house tour and you guys are new, then you can see it now. But so we changed our blinds to curtains. You wanna show them? Yep, these are the curtains that I put up. Really aesthetic, makes the room look like just way more modern, kind it of like does. a Airbnb hotel vibe in here. It just I just like it better than the blinds. And because Snap and Thor, literally in the middle of the night, like to look out the window and the, the blinds will sound like this. They literally move. So the curtains, dead quiet. Cats can't do anything from that. But they like to that. play behind it so they would play with the blinds and wake us up and that was so annoying. I'm like, I'm done with it. When I first else. installed these, actually, they fell down. The cats were playing on it. I didn't install them yeah. fully into the we wall. We woke up. And the drywall pulled out and- We woke up to a big bang. Like but, someone broke it and But I fixed it. Out. So it's okay. Yeah. It's all good. And last time we were also in this room, we did the lull bed tour. We only had a bed in here. That's oh, literally the yeah. only thing we set up. But this is our bed now. We have extra pillows that we added we found these cute little lamps at target pretty nice and it matches the bed set perfectly yeah. got our nightstands up i remember me and her built those like the first night yeah we did we built and just a fan just, just a simple fan. room i like but to then, have a little bit of noise at night you know yeah just just like you know the the white noise or the calm noise or whatever it is so she needs to have some our bathroom really didn't change much besides the are you kidding babe yes it did i know it did the painting it the did. flooring the baseboard look at the sinks guys hold on i want to throw an old footage of these sinks right here look at this compared to what we had in the house yeah, nasty, nasty ceramic yellow crap and these just look like beautiful beautiful. beautiful sinks and the countertops sorry that if the mirror handles dirty. you um, can't even tell we, decide, nice. we literally decided we wanted to film this house tour like an hour ago so we try to hurry up and clean it yeah we try to we're not going to take you in our closet though so our closet's the same and our closet we're actually that's our next duty which we'll show you guys like obviously we can just show you guys one of our vlogs but that's the next project oh. it literally looks like ass it's like, like it looks like. You know what? Let's, talk, let's just. Let's okay, just we'll just show ourselves. you. We'll show you right now. Ready for this? Ah, oh, yeah. No, oh, yeah. that's all you can see. It's, it's bad. bad. It's bad, guys. But I feel like that's a lot of closets. We just have too much clothes and not enough closet space. But so this is obviously really didn't change much. We just added a little bit of rugs. We also added a new toilet. New I toilet. Don't even think we showed some rugs. Our toilet. Before. We got a bidet oh, right bidet. there. Yeah, this is our toilet, guys. The only light that we didn't change in the house. Fun fact. Is this light? Yeah, we don't need but to we're gonna change it. And I'm also I'm adding lights in here, and I'm getting rid of that light because it just it looks crappy and it's really dark in there. But I did put all of our shampoos up, so the shower is looking uh, the only way thing nicer. Is for our next home. Obviously, I want our shower to be huge. Like this is just shower and uh, closet. Yeah, this shower is nice. I just wish it was more bright and like not so outdated, but it's still. Nice. It's still the flooring and everything makes it look yeah. better. But yeah. that's basically it for our master bedroom. Now uh, this is the fun stuff. This is the fun stuff guys we i'm can just, we can so mix excited with, we can mix the office in because the office doesn't really change a lot no except i still need a paint in there but it's more about it's not even about that it's just about all about the what we put in there okay yeah. so are you ready this, yes. is the grand, this is the grand grand room right here this so is our wait, favorite show the light switches really quick so, so we did only have two switches here one controlled the fan and one controlled this light above us i put in an extra switch and i wired all of these lights <laughs> these 10 lights right here Right there, 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 there. I wired all these lights, put a new fan in, and wired it all in here so now we could like control Before it from here. Before we even show you guys what the living room looks like, I just wanna show you guys how actually dark the room was without these lights. I'm just gonna turn it off really quick to show them a before of how bright. Yeah, this is how it looked. So it was this dark. Which you can't even really tell. No, you can, because look at it. Oh, them yeah. on. It's, it's a big difference it's in person, guys. But person. let's go into the room now. So this is our living room. I know, Thor, what's up? Sleeping. He's like, yeah, I'm not being a part. So is Snap. Snap's sleeping in there. But we did just recently get a new couch. Guys. so fun. If you do not remember our nasty apartment couch that we had. Basically a sofa couch. Oh, this thing is 10 times better. Look, it just looks like something Look, you'd want to sleep on. It's literally a bed. You can move it. You can, it's, it's a, a twin bed, bed, like that big. Yeah. And she has her shoes on the nice couch, so. I, I'm the tips of it. <laughs> No, your whole back of your, okay, whatever. Tip, but. Just the tip. Show how actually big the couch looks. Like, bring it close, like, really give them a good look. Yeah, this guys, couch this basically couch. goes the whole span of the room almost. Came with a cool ottoman that we could fit our blankets in and everything. I would show you guys, but Thor kind of. Yeah, we don't want to move Thor. And a good place for our cat to sleep. This guy's annoying. Thor's not annoying. Thor's Let the man sleep. sleep, who cares? We're disturbing him. He ain't disturbing us. 
And then also over here, we have Snap and Thor's little like, they like to sleep on it. And then right here in the middle, we had we added a lot of stuff, but this is our same entertainment yeah. center that we had in our apartment. And then we put a bigger TV. Yeah, bigger TV, that's what I want in our house. And then we added these shelves to hang our plaques. Guys, also, 100%, thank you guys so much. Our Marble Vlogs YouTube channel, if you do not subscribe to it, we have like 200 something thousand on there. Our Mariah and Bill, obviously we hit 100K, and we hit a million on this channel last year at our apartment, which like is super dope. Yeah. So we have to display them on top, just to show like how much we love and appreciate you. We actually you. need to post on our Marble Vlogs. We haven't posted in a while, because we've been so busy, but well, we're we started, we didn't, we didn't post because of vlogs. Vlogmas. Maybe we, we stopped in the vlogmas. Maybe we can do since Anne and Anthony were going to see them. We can do like a canvas painting contest. Oh, we should. We should just also, to post on our. We're it. gonna start posting on a vlog channel. We just stopped because the like, Christmas vlogmas and everything. Yeah, I I don't know why we didn't film on our vlog show with Jules and saw it, but it's all right. We'll see. It's okay. Again soon. Yeah, we'll see him again. So, this is the most exciting part too because before. The, our couch came in. It was like kind of made the house dark. Yeah, the couch was a darker gray. I, so I can't even imagine what that would have looked like with it. I feel like it wouldn't have correlated right. No. This couch makes this whole living room and what is I'm looking at right now just so bright. And it matches the floor and everything. Oh. Are you ready to see our kitchen, guys? Come Ooh. on, count down with us. I'm Three, two, two, one. Oh my. Yeah, that's that's kind of small, but guys, look at this kitchen show, area. Show this, guys. this is our new counter that we got. It's so much more sparkly in person. I don't know if you guys can tell. Oh yeah, you can see the sparkles. It is right? really sparkly. You can see it sparkle. Oh yeah, you can see it in the camera. So there's a lot of sparkle. It's a white sparkly, uh, what's it called, glass flake on the inside Before. of this quartz countertop. Before, the countertops were literally up to here. Right? Yeah, there was a two-story counter. It looked ugly as hell. We had a small double sink. Look at this sink. Don't mind this. When they cut our countertops, the dust got all over our eating utensils, so I had to wash them off. But yeah. look at how big this Mariah can literally like bathe in this sink. I could bathe in it. It's we got a new sink uh, faucet, new soap dispenser. Just super, super I don't nice. Think you guys realize how big of a change this is? No. Because it is. Oh, dude, our old counters, counters look so bad. I'm just so like, look at how much it blends. Like, look at how everything just is so bright and pretty and just. This is oh. literally right here the image we wanted for our house. Th first things are lighting. We wanted good white lighting. Yeah. Second things was we like grays, whites, and blacks, and yeah. we really, and really and, gr and some green here and there like that plant over there that we got and we kind of decked out the top of our cabinets also with some LEDs we got some LEDs under here but we're gonna put up some backsplash because we didn't do this Let me yet show you guys a little bit of an example so this is the backsplash that we got that Bill's gonna put up so basically it's gonna go are you saying it's going you want to go all the way up yeah and the light makes it blue it's actually a white backsplash but the light makes it blue we I don't know why we have it on blue setting but yeah, yeah it's gonna go from either. here all the way up to the top of this and it's gonna wrap all the way around the kitchen also we changed all of the handles and everything on here, on the drawers, on this. We got a new cabinet that we have to wait for the door to come in because they need to match these doors to the ones that we already have. But this is, I wanted this so bad. We had a garbage can here before. We now we have garbage. a pull out double garbage and it's gonna be so nice when the door's actually on yeah. there and they all match. Before but, we had the garbage can right here and I just feel like there were so many bugs and like just And like, food would get everywhere. Yeah. Like now that it's tucked away inside, I don't even like staring at a garbage can guys I like the, the hideaway garbage can that stuff will not be there that's just building material for the backsplash that I'm putting in but what here is think? this we also raised this because this was like half a foot shorter than this counter yeah. it was really weird is it just so beautiful like I'm like actually in love it really just makes me feel more homey dude look at you like right now it like if you see yourself in this camera you oh look so God. good like that's what we wanted. We wanted to be able to film and stuff without having a ring light. And even if we need a ring light for an extra little light yeah. in, in your face, it's still the lighting in here. Like, look at this. This is our dream home for our first home. Like it, I could not ask for anything more. And we haven't even finished yet. We still have to show you the guest bathroom. Yeah, the guest bathroom. Because the guests are treated pampered yeah, they in are. their room, but. Yeah. And look at guys, this is little Bill's little flower bear. I think that's a cute spot. I'm really hoping the cats don't mess with it because I really like it there. I think it adds some flavor. I got it for Valentine's Day. Yeah, I'll be really mad if the cats start eating it, cause then I gotta move it. Don't worry, they won't. No, they probably will. <laughs> so, um, obviously this is still our kitchen table. Um, it's not the cutest, but that is our other. It's next, cute. It's just that's tiny. That's our next next big purchase is to get a really fancy kitchen table. Not fancy, just one that looks good. Yeah, that makes. We don't it. need anything fancy. We just want something that looks. Cause look at you got snap. 
teeth marks all over the seats. Yeah, like yeah, we need new seats and a table. It's but right. we'll also show you a little bit of the outside after we're done with the inside. But going over to our hallway, we also painted. Obviously, the flooring's done, and then our pantry. pantry. Oh, it's a little messy. But it's kind of messy. It's not that bad. I did some organizing, but this is our pantry. We also did not have a washer and dryer in here when we first started so which that's the next thing in our next home which we do plan to like not we're not gonna be living here for a really long time we're gonna be living here for around two to three years that's our goal but or more depending on where life goes yeah but we want to get like a really big like walk-in laundry room like that's a must-have in the next house yeah right? like an actual room to be I able to go in i hate having to bring our laundry and our, it's sitting right here yeah like, it's it's not bad no. but like it would be better if we had a room the size of this bathroom that we're gonna show you right now so this is our guest bathroom guys and if you're a guest, if you're coming to our home, we got you right. We made this bathroom pimped out to a modern ass liking. We got the dream. Do you guys remember that? That's um, from our apartment. That's from our apartment. Do you guys remember that? Yeah, that was on our wall by our so windows, cute. our balcony. Oh. Back in the day. <laughs> well, it actually brings back so many memories. I know. And then we have this. It's actually from one of our fan pages. When we did our P.O. This. box, yeah. someone sent us that, which is super dope. Because we got a lot of, oh yeah, G. We got a lot of cool stuff from people. So this is basically like the aesthetic. It's the same vibe as our master. We just did it. You know, a little smaller yeah. in here, obviously. And then that's the shower tub area yeah. with some nice rugs and just an all-around good vibe in the bathroom. So I do have my laundry in the guest room because yeah, yesterday she, I had to put it in here for when, when the counter people, people were doing it. She didn't finish her laundry yet, and she threw everything in the guest room. So just don't look at that and, and it, that. Don't look at any of this. But this, okay. So this is what it would look like if you take this off. You take this, this. It would be like all like. It's really nice right and here. simple. It has the Marble Squad, which another Mariah's old friend. Made her this and yeah. more greenery but this is our guest bedroom in here also put new fans in the whole house as you can see it's another like gray white kind of vibe we want the whole house to match but also be like really modern we changed the bed sheets too i feel like or the bed covers i feel like this looks really cute in it here. does way better than what we we had it was like kind of brownish before yeah. which is still nice but not as nice and then we got our mirror over here so guests can like look at themselves if they need a mirror little closet that mariah takes over because we don't have enough room in our closet Oh, that's one thing guys is the closet's gonna be a must-have too if the closet is not big bye-bye and on to our last in room not including the garage this is mariah's vanity room we don't have enough space in our bedroom to fit her vanity I next house we want to but this no, is her actually no no you want to know something what i want what? i want the vanity room i want my own vanity room because i actually want to really duck this out like i want to get it make it all what sparkly. do you want like a 10 bedroom house no i want to make it like sparkly and like pretty but if there's another room i want it to be closer to mine yeah why would room. you want to wake up every day and walk all the way across the house to get ready. I'm not. That's what I'm saying. I want the room. If there is a room next to our master bedroom, we get our new home. I can put that in there and make it my whole bedroom. Well, just, it just depends on the layout, but we definitely want this closer to our bedroom. Yes. But she uses this for the cat room and for her vanity makeup room. Also, new fans. Also, the whole house has new switches and hardware, new outlets. This is where the kitties go to the bathroom and like all their kitty food and stuff, which is cool because it's on the other end of the house and which the guests I, don't smell any of the cats. So. I hate walking all, you guys know how bad it is. I have to walk all the way over here and my clothes are all the way across the house. This is probably one of the most annoying things ever, but I do like having my own vanity room. Yeah, it's fine. We, we love it still. I want to deck it out. Maybe we could put like, I kind of want to do like a cat tower in here. Put like a little like cat like thing they can like chill and like when I'm doing my makeup and stuff. Do like a whole chill. wallpaper kind yeah, of thing. Like, like a little theme. We can. Wall paper no like it like a theme like like a theme wall it'll look good she it's not old looking wallpaper it's like nice new <laughs> okay whatever she said anything that she says think she thinks said. she's so smart I, know, I don't think you understand you said, said cat tower and then i said yeah behind that you could put all like a nice new like texture oh, okay. type of wall okay i thought you were talking about like a cat wallpaper ew <laughs> no why would we want to do that that would just ruin everything so now we totally did not show the outside yet we got a lot more stuff out here what Kitties. oh yeah they love they're outside like oh, i want to go outside <laughs> And it's all screened in too, so they can like they, they don't have to worry about him running away. They know exactly when the door opens, and they hear the back door open. Yeah, they know they know when to come out here. But we did a lot more. Well, kind of a lot more. We got a grill. Mariah's dad got us a grill, which is awesome. I think it was windy yesterday because they, everything's tipped over. Yeah, all of our floaties are everywhere. Yeah. So but anyways, we also got this couch sitting area, which is super dope with a nice rug that we found. Yeah, we wanted to do more out here, but honestly, like I feel like we're gonna go all out on our next home. 
home and like we're really modern out outside. But I feel like this is a perfect Well, it's little by stuff. little, literally. Like it's hard to find stuff that all matches and like you don't know where to put stuff. Like we don't know what to put here, but like it's still, it looks good like bare because it's not bare, but at the same time it, there could be something here. We just we don't know. That we also got a heater too? If you have not seen our recent videos, like anything that we've done to the pool, we also got a pool heater that we can get this baby up to like 98 degrees. Or, no, 102. It's amazing. Maybe. Maybe it might be 98. I don't know. Either way, it's warm because it gets cold here in the winter, like yeah. 60s. And to have like a 60 degree pool in the winter is freaking freezing and you want it to be like oh, 90. All of our friends love our heated pool. Oh, yeah. That was like the best thing. Otherwise, we wouldn't use it. The other thing that I do want to get switched is a saltwater pool because chlorine is not really good for your skin. And I, especially in the winter time, I wear self tanner. It soaks my self tanner off my skin. Look at this. Yeah, I don't know if you guys knew you can get saltwater pools. Like they just change your filtration system and they make it all salt water. Mariah's looking at snap right now. He's like, what is that? It's a floaty, dude. It's a floaty. Oh yeah, and one more thing. We got a fence, guys. We got a white PVC fence across our whole yard because we wanted more privacy. It kind of cuts off half the houses, which is super dope. And believe it or not, it's six feet tall. So like, it doesn't look like it from here because the house is raised, but it's a six foot tall fence, which is awesome. Also that plant right there. Oh. I'm not gonna show it cause it gets super dark, but there's a plant over there oh. and it's totally dead right now cause it's winter, but it gets really cool and blooms like into pretty flowers yeah. in the summer, which is awesome. Also, I wanna show a little bit of the front of the house. I'm not gonna show the whole thing, but we did replace, oh, I'm still doing it over there, but we did replace the, like the nasty mulch with this nice white rock over we here. We should finish it while it's winter. Yeah, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna do that over there and then also, I already started doing this and I already have the rock here. I just have to get like this curb thing made, the cement curb, so it holds all the rock in and it'll look so nice. But the red mulch that they had here Ew. was just disgusting. It was nasty. I don't know why anyone would like that, but if like. You guys didn't know, we also got a golf cart. Oh yeah, if you didn't see that video, we also got our baby golf cart right here. So it's our garage, nothing really updated in here. Yeah, you can't still... really see that, hold on. It's still messy in here because I still have to clean it. We're still working on the house and everything, but basically. Yeah, Christmas. We don't have an attic, so we can't put anything. We do have an attic, but Bill doesn't want to put anything up Nothing there. fits up there. Literally, nothing fits up there. The, the hole to get up, there's no hole in the garage. The hole to get up there is in our closet, and it's like two feet by two feet. It's a little square. You can't fit that big ass box in the attic. I think you can. I'm telling you right now, you can't. Bill I'm not even going to argue. Can. I, I put so many boxes up there. Did you even know that? I put like seven boxes up there. You did? Only the ones that I could fit. You can barely fit shit up there. You can there. definitely fit those. No, you can't. You can't, babe. Uh, she you, doesn't know. You she, able to stand up she's there. She's never even been in the attic. Box, she's never even been in the attic, so she wouldn't even know. I swear, every time I walk back in here, I fall in love with the house again. It's so freaking bright and just amazing. Everything we do is to make the house look better. This countertop changed the whole game. Oh, it did. The countertop before was this ugly laminate color, and it just It was didn't yellow. Feel Everything was yellow. Yeah. Whole, everything was yellow. I don't know why, but everything was yellow. And like whoever owned this house before just did not have good taste or they just didn't care about the house. In our apartment too, we made that apartment look so freaking good. Our apartment had the best lighting. I changed, you're not supposed to change out the lighting, but I undid all the electrical. Yeah. I changed all the lighting to these white lights. And then we switched it back and we were like, wow. I switched it back the day like. that we were leaving, the day before we left. I had to switch it all back so they didn't find out that we switched it. That's crazy. And our apartment literally had the best lighting ever. And I, I guarantee to you right now, this house on the inside has the best lighting out of every single house in this neighborhood. Oh, 100%. I've literally, we've lived here for like nine months now. So like I've not seen one house really with like white light. And if they do have white light, it's only on the exterior. Guys, we're just really proud because we've, we've worked so hard to like finish this house. It's been a long journey of painting. Well, for Bill, it, Bill's been- I did, I did like 95% of everything. She helped me with painting with a little bit. Yeah, I just, I do a lot of the house stuff, like cleaning. I do all like the- um, um, she takes care of the cats. Yeah, I do a lot of different stuff. Bill's just the handy dandy man. That but hands down, moving into a house was probably the best decision we've ever made. I don't even care if we bought it in a high market. Our house still went up in value a lot, even oh though we bought gosh, it in a high yeah. market. But honestly, I don't even care. Like best investment ever for me is a house because like you can do whatever the heck you want. You can make it exactly how you want. And, and no one's controlling you. Nobody controls you. You could stay up until freaking, you know, three in the morning and nobody's going to yell at you. Yeah. Exactly. Literally like we can do whatever we want here. And on top of that, like we can make it look badass like we did. Some people don't like, you know, really make their houses look badass, but I or feel they like. they don't like it. They like different, everyone likes different things. But for us, I don't we know. like the bright look. We just, it's just. I feel like this is like it. staying in an Airbnb every day. Like you wake up and it's just like, you feel like you're literally in an Airbnb. Oh my gosh, this house is 
house is just my favorite. And I always say like, oh, we're gonna, this isn't even our dream home. Like our next home is gonna be like crazy. But for now, for the years that we're gonna be here. I don't even wanna leave. I don't even wanna so leave much. either. We're never gonna sell this house. I might rent it out, but like, I'm never gonna, I don't wanna sell it unless like it really went up in value because like, I love it so much. It's like, I have like an attachment to it now. I have an attachment to it too. Especially cause I did all the work. Like, like I would wanna rent it out to our family. So yeah, cause some family. random people, they'll probably F it up and they'll probably yeah, like, they, will. they won't care about it as much as we care about it. So like, I don't know. Either way guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I know we went super quick, but that's just because we literally had so much to show you. Like from showing you guys an apartment tour, it takes like 10 minutes. Yeah. The house tour, if we took our time, it would probably be like an hour long video. So I'm glad that we were able to smush it all in in this video. And you could see like the before and after yeah. of a lot of the house because like it, to be honest, looked like crap. It did, it did. <laughs> like, we thought it looked terrible. so good. I mean, it did look good, but like it was like not as like, once you see the afters of like the before and afters, you realize, wow. Oh, every single insane. door had a different door handle. I don't even know if we showed you, but these door handles are all new too. They had, they had brown door handles. They had like brass door what? handles, all these crappy door after handles. After this video, since you guys are gonna be basically seeing our our um, unfurnished house. Go watch the other one. You're gonna see it because we already threw in um, the clips before, but I'm gonna go watch it because now I wanna see what the house looked like before. If you wanna see our full house tour, make sure to go on our YouTube channel and type in like Mariah and Bill house tour because the old one will come up and you guys can actually see the full yeah. Like every the whole long video this because like amazing. it's night and day. It looks like two different houses. It does. But guys, we hope you enjoyed our fully furnished house tour. There's obviously still some little things that we're going to adjust. We wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update. It's basically 95% really done. Yeah. And uh, yeah, like I said, what better a time than a day after we get our countertops and our new sink? Yeah. We want to also add some more pictures in here and stuff like that. But I feel like everything's basically done, and we're really excited. Little by little, it yeah. takes a long time to fill up a house. It so does. It does. We're doing it. You you know, as we we go. did it pretty quick. Nine months. That's a lot that we've done in nine months. Like we really busted it out. Uh, me? Are you kidding me? I've like, been working okay. on this out every freaking day almost. I helped you too, though. Uh, I, helped I you know. Too. I'm not saying you didn't help, but like I was. I I've been motivated. I love yeah, getting stuff he done. Does. He's he's my handyman. <laughs> but we hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and, and we, we will see you in the, the next, next one. But, but until then, then peace. Love, love you guys. guys.